Благодарю вас. Уважаемые коллеги, дамы и господа. Dear colleagues, ladies and gentlemen, today I do not overestimate. It was the benchmark milestone e event for all our countries. We have signed the Convention on the Legal Status of the Caspian Sea. This is an international agreement which has a detailed rules and obligations for the use of our common uh, richness legacy. Multi uh, f faceted cooperation between the five countries now has legal framework for many years ahead. It is important that the Convention provides the five countries with sovereign rights for the use uh, of its subsoil and other resources. It guarantees the settlement of all the topical issues of the agenda on the basis of consensus and uh, mutual consideration of interests and ensures the peaceful status of the Caspian Sea, non-presence of uh, armed forces of non-parties. We try to achieve this for many years. We try to develop and design this document, strategic document. We have conducted many negotiations between our agencies, between our experts and businesses. We have achieved a success, and this success is the result of trust and mutual understanding between the heads of the Caspian states, is, is the result of respect, partnership, and equal approach. I would like to express gratitude to all the heads of state present here. This collective approach showed its effectiveness, and it showed that by collective efforts we can achieve ambitious goals, ambitious goals, and we can find a balanced solutions for the mutual interests. I would like to repeat, in the current uh, complex international relations, this is a very important thing. This convention promotes relations between the Caspian states, allows us to ensure dynamic development and growth and stability of our countries. I'm happy to emphasize that we have signed a set of documents which supplement the convention with regard to the topical matters. The Caspian states want plan to deepen economic cooperation, expand trade and investment ties, cooperate in the field of energy, development of transport and logistics capacity, and increase uh, transport flows and tourist flows. We want to preserve biodiversity and rich nature of the Caspian Sea. The Caspian states pay huge attention to the, field, to the issue of security, to the current challenges and threats. It is important to remember that the Caspian Sea is located near to some hot spots uh, in the Middle East to some tourist locations. So that is why it is important to ensure good cooperation between our border and the law enforcement agencies. All these topics allows us to speak about long-term good prospects. We still face very interesting and important challenges. Once again, in conclusion, I would like to express gratitude to our Kazakh colleagues, to President Nursultan Nazarbayev for hospitality and warm welcome. And I would like to congratulate all of us for the successful organization of the summit. Thank you very much.